Hey YouTube, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to wire your 4L60 slash 4L80 neutral safety switch to work with any LS swap. This applies to this style neutral safety switch you see photoed here, 97 to 02 ish 4L60 or 4L80. I'm going to start by showing you the pinout. I noted the wiring colors, but that's not really what you're going to be looking for. What you're going to be looking at is the pin terminal to the function. The first thing I'm going to show you is how to turn on your reverse lamps. You will want to send 12 volts to pin C via a fused connection that comes from the ignition switch. You're going to want to connect pin F to your backup reverse light wire. Chances are if you've already had an automatic or even a manual transmission, you're going to have the wire right there. Otherwise, you can run this to your reverse lamp circuit. The power is going to come in from pin C. When you put it in reverse, it's going to go out through pin F. Unfortunately, I don't have a tripod or anything to show you, but... I've got the multimeter set to an audible tone, which you can probably hear in the background. And then this would be the transmission. And we're going to put it back in park. And as you can see, the noise goes away. And I can't really get it in reverse. I don't want to make this video shaky. But if I was to get that back in reverse, you'd see the sound would come back on, indicating that we've completed the circuit and the power will go through for the reverse. On to pin A, park neutral signal. When you test the wires, you'll find that it has continuity between pin D, which is ground. So whenever you put it in park or neutral, you will have a connection. All right, guys, thank you for watching my video. I hope I helped somebody out there. I did want to note that if for whatever reason you needed to send 12 volts to energize whatever circuit it is, to allow you to turn the key and operate the starter, the actual starter solenoid, uh, you could just do the same exact method except use a relay.